hi friends welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i am going to cover how we can write on submit line script so i already made two videos uh, for on change and on load line script so you can refer these two videos at any time uh, but in this video i am going to talk about on submit line script so i am going to take one use case on incident form so what i am trying to show you that if the state changes to cancel and that time work notes becoming mandatory so if you wanted to change the state to cancel and if you wanted to save or update the incident form it will give um, give you one uh, prompt message that work notes it's mandatory or you need to set valuing the work notes then only it will allow you to submit this form or save the form otherwise not so same way you have to open one incident form you have to go to the context menu right banner the gray banner right clicks open the context menu go to configure and then you will get client script so um, i'm opening my um on um, uh, my client script form and there you have to select the type of this client script is on submit remember we always write on submit client script when we are we need to validate something during submitting the form or saving the form or updating the form so here also i am doing the same thing i am putting one if condition where it is um, uh, taking the value from the form level taking the value of the field from the form level that is the state field and if you see that g underscore form dot get value uh, and as a parameter i am passing state field and then is equal to 8 8 means the value of the cancel state and also i am uh, putting another condition that is g underscore form dot get value work notes is empty so if the state is cancelled and work notes is empty that time it will restrict user to save or submit the form otherwise it will allow so i'm done with my script i'm saving it now let us go back to the incident form so i'm opening one existing incident ticket and here you can see the current state is new so what i'm going to do i'm going to change the state to cancel and here you see if i try to update it i'm getting this message that please provide work notes because I am making this field mandatory through that on submit script. So now I am putting the work notes and now this time it should allow me to submit it. So now you can see that I can update the form. So that is how we can validate anything during our submission through the on submit line script. So this is what we covered in this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you.